got it! Open it up on the straightaways, Giddy!
14. 14 is the winner. Le 14. Numero 14, la gagno. I think you mean two. Am I correct? Uh, no, monsieur. 14 is the winner. I think you've made a mistake. I'm sorry, sir. 14 is the winning number. Better luck next time, eh? That does it! That Calavera is getting too big for his britches. I don't like raiding businesses and shutting them down. But someone's got to teach Manuel a lesson in law and order. This way, back here. Open those paddy wagons up and start filling them. And somebody find Calavera. I want to interrogate him personally. Raided? How long are they going to close it for? Huh? Yeah, you better cut off the big guy's credit then. Yeah, yeah. Throw the drunk out on his big orange butt. And bring me Calavera so we can talk about his debt. Hey, come on! You gotta let me back in! I'm a VIP! Does that stand for very inebriated pianist? Oh, many. I don't want to be a pianist anymore. I'm a mechanic. I know. That's why I got you a new job. Come on, let's go pick up your tools. And I can do whatever I want to the engine? Make it faster? Sure, but you'll be plenty busy just keeping her afloat. Thanks for the gig, and for not asking too many questions. Hell, after what happened in Naranja, I can see why you'd leave town. Let's just hope I don't have to go fishing you out of the drink again. I'll stay under next time. I promise. Captain Calavera? Puerto Zapato, sailor. We're here at last. Beautiful port, isn't she? Yes, sir. There's some customs officials down below, sir. They want to search the ship. Fine, fine. We've got nothing to hide, eh? No skeletons in our closet. <laughs> yes, sir. Secure the bow, boys. Like a rock this time. Manuel. Salvador? I hope this very urgent message gets to you in time. Our man in Zapato says Miss Colomar never made it to the port. It said she threw herself overboard at the Pearl. I don't know if you believe that. Whatever you do, do not land in Puerto Zapato. It's a trap. Assassins will attempt to board your ship disguised as customs agents. Beware, and viva la revolución! Sorry I led you into trouble, sailor. I'm sorry I led you into trouble, sailor. Ensign Arnold was just a kid. I'm not gonna disrupt the evidence. I'm sorry I led you into trouble. Oh, no. This can't be happening. Hey! He's back here! Sack him! Custom officials, open this door! 
Yeah, we want to check your bags. Don't worry, Captain. We're safe in here. Okay, let's just set the explosives and get the hell out of here. Gladys, do something. Okay. Gladys, do something. Okay. I think the best way to use this engine would be the controls over there, as opposed to the hands-on method. Equally. Gladys sure did a number on that old diesel. If it were just a little more powerful, we could probably tear on out of here. I tried. Oh, I tried. But I failed. It's not powerful enough. Hey, maintain, sailor. It's bolted down. I think the best way to use this engine would be the controls over there, as opposed to the hands-on method. Okay. Can't can't reach. My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used Oh, sure. Now I find an actual rusty anchor. It says, inspected by number 36?
That's the throttle for the port side engine. My scythe. It would probably be easier to raise it with the motor. There you go. Can't reach. Can't reach. Can't reach. Gladys, cover your ears. What was that? The dotted line, buddy. Snap out of it, sailor. Easy for you to say. You don't have lungs. Hey, you live without your heart once, so you can live without air for a little while. Just until I figure out what we're gonna do.
You all right? I'm a spirit of the land, Manny, not of the sea. Hang in there, Mano. Beware, brave captain. Here in the darkest depths of the Sea of Lament dwell the most horrible monsters of all. The fearsome, murky demons of the deep will swallow you whole the instant you leave this pool of light. Heed my warning, or take one step forward and learn for yourself. All right, all right, I believe you. Just quit it with the creepy spirit of the land voice, huh? Here comes one now! I'd definitely go over there first chance I get, but there's a lot of dark water between here and there. Amigo! Huh? Who? Oh, geez, another shipwreck. You see? That's why I never travel by boat! What are you doing down here? Trying to get out of the land of the dead, same as everybody else. Why are you walking instead of taking a ship? Got sick of waiting around Rubicava for a boat. Figured I'd make better time this way. Why didn't I think of that? How do you know where you're going? See the moon over there? I just keep it on my right. That way I know I'm heading in a straight line. But oldest trick in the book. How long have you been down here? Well, let me put it this way. I wasn't always this color. Shouldn't you have hit dry land by now? I'm trying to cross a big ocean here, Sonny. What do you know about it? I've already done it. In a boat. A boat? Don't talk to me about boats. What's the problem with boats? We had such a nice boat. Why is everybody always talking about boats? You got a perfectly good pair of legs. Why not use them, I say? Let me guess. You died in a boat wreck. A boat wreck would have been better than what happened to us. Led off course by bad equipment, lost for weeks, no food, no shelter from the sun. We'd started throwing the dead overboard. But then the sharks began following the boat. What happened in the end? What happened was, I learned three valuable lessons. Stay away from boats. When it comes to navigation, trust only the moon and the stars. And when there's only two of you left, never, ever go to sleep. How have you kept that light going all these years? Well, I found this coral, this glow-in-the-dark coral. Damnedest thing. Glows like a lightning bug and never seems to wear out. I had some of that once. Made a nice grappling hook. I don't think you had what I got, because I don't think you've been to the place where I got it. Where'd you get the coral? Edge of the world, boy. That's the only place it grows. Is everything okay with your eyebrows? Them is barnacles, genius. I don't move fast enough to shake them, so they tend to pile up. I don't mind, though. They're the only company I got. <laughs> Ain't you, boys? We've had a little accident. Think you could help us out? Depends on what kind of help you're looking for. Could you take us to the Pearl? Ha! You don't believe those old stories, do you? You think somewhere in this ocean there's a gigantic pearl that shines so brightly it can be seen from passing ships? And that sometimes sailors so allured by its luster actually fling themselves overboard to dive for it and are never heard from again? Yeah, and I think it's right over... Bah! I've been walking this ocean for years. I ain't never seen it. No, really. The pearl is right over there. You poor sucker. That's the moon. Tell me you didn't come all this way out here to pearl dive the moon. <laughs> Could we borrow that light for a second? Sorry. I'm kind of attached to it. <laughs> Could we tag along with you? Well, it's a long walk you're talking about. We don't have any other choice. Oh, all right then. Lift those knees, stick close to my light, and try to sing in key. This little light of mine 
I'm gonna let it shine, this little light of mine. I'm gonna let it shine, this little light of mine. I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Hide it under some seaweed, no. I'm gonna let it shine, hide it under some seaweed, no. I'm gonna let it shine, hide it under some seaweed, no. I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Scare away sea monsters, yeah. I'm gonna let it shine, scare away sea monsters. I'm not gonna let you touch it. No, I'm gonna let it shine. I'm not gonna let you touch it. No, I'm gonna let it shine. Not gonna let you touch it. No, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine. That's just a trick the ocean plays on your mind, kid. Makes everything look the same after a while, like he was going in circles. Well, this isn't the kind of progress I was hoping for. Oh, well, the wet march of the soul ain't for everybody. Could you send for help? Oh, sure. I promise to call for help at the next phone booth I walk by. Well, I don't want to break your stride there. Okay, see you around. Watch out for sea monsters. Who? These guys? Oh, they don't mess with old Chipito. I'm too bright for them. <laughs> this little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine. Hey, lay off. Let go. Let go. What am I supposed to do with this? Follow me? Where are you taking me? To the moon. Benny, is that... The Pearl! Whee! I knew I'd find her someday! I'm rich, 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 rich! Shh! Something's happening. Benny, what's going on? the way that thing's looking at us. Claudius, go down there and talk demon talk to that octopus. Heck no! I'm scared! I'm staying up here with you! Claudius. Heck! Bruh. 